and anything. Ow! I scratched myself. Ouch. Anywho. Hello, this is Connie, and you're currently balancing on top of my computer screen. So I'm a little concerned, and I'm wondering if I test this to see if this is even on, if I'm gonna be able to recreate this again. But Shirley is a lot better than the web screen, and the last time I used it, my voice went kr 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 kr. We'll try this in a second. Oh Lord, how did I do it? Awesome, run with it anyway. Hi guys, this is Connie and it's Friday. Thank you, Jesus. This week has had all sorts of interesting things happen. Um, you know, sometimes it felt like the world was fixing to lose its mind. Multiple situations going on throughout the world. Uh, Wars, chaos, people just fixing to lose their minds. And continued with work, people getting sick. I haven't gotten there yet, so I'm just gonna keep sleeping and drinking lots of fluids and hoping that I don't get sick. Yay! Fantastic week though. I wanted to eventually get to a part where I made a video on how can you relax. Now, what different ways can you use to de-stress your life? And I happened to Google that and found a really nice article in Women's Health that had eight different things that are going on that you can use, effective tools per se, to help uh, de-stress your life. And there's a couple of them on the screen right now. One says get a massage. That's always nice sometimes if you like being touched. I know some people that don't like being touched, so I want to just send you a happy card where it's like a hug with a piece of paper. Maybe. One says have a hot bath. If I'm not already hot enough, boy. Exercise daily. It says that you can uh, boost your endorphins by doing only 20 minutes a day. My doctor always says do a half an hour. All I know is that in 10 minutes, I'm covered in sweat and usually don't feel those happy endorphins so much later, like after the, either the hot bath or the shower. So, that's a thing. Another one says to meditate. Another one says listen to music. Another one, what did it, I want to know exactly what it said specifically here. Hold on, shake, 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 shake. Screw, 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 screw. Eat mood boosting foods. Which I wanted to brag on my students. Oh my gosh, totally did not expect this. I'm not usually a an avid uh, champion for Valentine's Day because I remember what it was like to be single for a very long time, whether it was being rejected for Valentine's Day or just not really caring about Valentine's Day. So I don't make a big deal about it. Um, but yeah, everybody's like, look, you should celebrate the next day because chocolate's, you know, on sale. That might have been the case. But I got this from my bus students. And actually, you know the thing that really excited me more than just the chocolate rose was the holographic, I don't know if you could see it, but the holographic little valentines that they added with it. I thought that was just the sweetest little thing and it made me smile and I appreciated it. And I got it from my bus students. So this was not mustachio. Mustachio treats me like it's Valentine's Day every day just by being mustachio because he's awesome. Let's try this again. So, in conclusion, I hope you have a fantastic Friday. I hope you have a great weekend. I hope that you find a way to treat yourself and not stress out. If this has been helpful, let me know. And if you're interested in learning more about it, I will post a link for the article. Just bypass all the advertisements that it keeps saying. Get yourself a bikini go out body. Do you know what? The only way you can exit out of that advertisement, its sister goes, no thanks, I've already got my bikini body. Click. I just don't want to receive your emails on a regular basis. Sorry. But I do like my body, even if it's not bikini ready. Yeah. Bye. Scoot, 